Hey everyone, it's Danielle from DQ Plans, and as promised, I have an unboxing today of my traveler's notebooks from Christina's Leathers, all the way in Portugal. I'm in California in the United States, so that's super exciting. I also have a couple other things that um, I got in the mail in the last couple weeks. Another thing I wanted to show you was this incredible Christmas present my husband got me. It's a couple pieces, um, so if you'll bear with me, it is not planning related, really. But the leather on these things. So we are huge baseball fans and there is a company called Baseballism. I'm going to link that below. That makes um, clothes and hats and they've started making accessories. And some of the accessories they've started making are purses. And this purse, which is huge, I totally know it, kind of a tote, is made of baseball glove leather. And the smell... Oh, it's unbelievable. It's absolutely gorgeous, supple glove leather. And you know from my first video that I love baseball glove leather. So I just want to give you a quick look inside. There's the company. Um, this is my athletic boosters pass. I don't really need that. There's a canvas pocket inside, zipper pocket. It's so gorgeous. This little knot, it's absolutely perfect. I love it. Um, the only bad thing about it is that I can't take it to work with me because I work at Starbucks. And when you leave Starbucks, you smell like Starbucks. And I don't want this leather smelling like Starbucks. So I do take the wallet with me, which it has their classic little logo. Um, opens up, cards. It says right on it, glove leather. Also smells absolutely divine. Um, cards, money, stuff, Kohl's cash. Got to spend that by the end of the week, I think. Um, but it's just, the detail is so great. I love it. The smell, of course, is wonderful. I am trying to get used to this closure. I'm sure I will. It'll be fine. This little uh, wristlet strap you probably can't see it and I don't, I'm, I'm filming in such a weird way because I'm filming at night and the shadows from the lights are weird. So I can't even see what I'm filming. So hopefully any of this comes out. But um, this wristlet strap says, For Love of the Game, which is a Kevin Costner movie, if anybody knows that. Um, but it's also just like a, a motto for so many baseball players and baseball families. This came on the purse, which I love little leather tags. I think it's so cool when they do this stuff. So it looks like a bag tag that my kids would put on their stuff with their name on it, but it's gonna go on my keychain for work. Um, so that's that, and I just wanted to share that with you. It's absolutely beautiful. It smells divine, and I love it. So I wanted to show you a few things that I've got. I guess it's a little bit of a haul, a little bit of a unboxing video. I am struggling with my acid reflux right now, and it's just absolutely affecting my voice. So I've got some water over here, just in case I need a break every once in a while, because we all know I love to talk. Um, so I picked up some, I knew I was ordering, I've ordered, I ordered a couple of notebooks from Christina's Leathers, and one of them was going to be pocket size, and so I wanted to get some Moleskine um, notebooks, the journals. I don't know how to say that. I don't know if it's Cahiers, Cahier, Cahier, I don't know. So it's these. These are the plain ones. Obviously it didn't come like this. I decided to get some um, acrylic paints from Michaels and I just really quick just wanted to see what that would look like and made a mess while doing it. Um, but these have a cool little pocket in the back which I really like. These are just again the plain ones. It's a set of three for $9.95. One other thing that's kind of neat about this, um, these is that they have a ruler on the inside. So it, it's just kind of nice if you need a template really quick. I kind of dig that. I also got the um, ruled journals. I haven't done anything in any of those yet. Um, but they also have the pocket in the back. I just think that's such a neat touch. Something that um, I hadn't seen before. I also made some dashboards. <laughs> I don't need dashboards. Um, well, maybe I do. Maybe I do. I don't know yet. Uh, I haven't set up a pocket yet. So I really was going all over the place on the internet and 
all over YouTube and Angie, um, I'll link her below. She had a video on how to do some dashboards and somebody else had it and I've been watching them all over. So I made a few dashboards. I love this like acetate paper. I don't know if that's what it is, but um, the only thing I need to do still, I rounded corners and I need to half punch a hole, like punch half a hole here so the elastics don't rub. So here are these. Um, I messed up on these because I don't want blank on the inside. So um, I will definitely redo those. And I figured that out really quickly that I didn't want any blank on the inside. Oh, so magic. Again, um, I corner, you know what, it's funny. Oh, I know. I rounded the corner on these two and so there is already a groove from rounding the corner like this so there's already a groove um, but these didn't do that because I used scissors so there's no little like not I'm super sorry if the glare's bad um, so that is those and I'm excited to use those I'm excited to kind of experiment a little bit with that this is my order from Amazon. Um, I do believe this is Sakura Dreams. I'm not positive. It's terrible. Oh, it is. Um, I ordered the a set of the Traveler's Notebook Insert Refill in the passport size, um, which I don't know if it's going to be too small for this. Well, I guess I could probably find out right now, right? Yeah, we'll be all right. Um, a set of three notebooks um, with the elastic bands and the um, sorry the <laughs> the plastic card slots like for um, credit cards and stuff. But I didn't notice that they had zipper pockets on the other side, so that's kind of cool. So I'll start with this. This says right on it, this is the set. Don't separate the set. Under penalty of law. I'm going to separate the set. They can prosecute me. Separated. Anyway, this is the um, refill set with the connection bands, the zipper case, which if i know, known, uh, I don't know. Um, the zipper case, a craft file folder, um, a monthly diary, and a lined notebook. And then there are these little sticky notes that I just love. They're super cute. Um, it's nice to have in your notebook, no matter what size you use. So here is the 001 Traveler's Notebook lined. I didn't realize also that the passport size notebooks all have their um, covers are colored. I didn't know that. Um, here's the little information sheet and the little passport, faux passport page. And then it's just lined. Super simple, no pockets, no fuss, no muss, easy peasy. This is 006, this is the um, monthly diary. And I just wanted to try something a little bit different. Not so much as a planner, but just for reference. So let's see what we got here. There's that signature square page, a couple note pages. This is undated. Mm -hmm. I think, I don't know if I knew that or not. Not that big of a deal. I don't know. I don't know if I'll even use this, honestly. But I wanted the kit because I wanted the, I love the craft folder. I'm so sorry if you hear my husband's um, French Bulldogs in the background, two of them. You'll either hear them snort or bark. They're a little bit of a pain. Um, so this is the 010 craft pocket folder. I love these. I just think they're so cool. They, um, folders on each side, they're fun to decorate. Super simple, and it's just always nice to have an extra pocket. Here are the bands with instructions in Japanese. And the first time that I saw them, I freaked out because I was like, okay, I can see pictures, but seriously, you 
You have to put everything just in Japanese? I mean, you know, you're a Japanese company, but come on, right? Because I'm super all about me. In English, on the inside. I followed the pictures, it wasn't that hard, but just four bands, um, two brown, two black. I don't think I've used the black ones in all my other um, notebooks yet. Actually, I still only have one notebook, but I've opened, um, I've used three of the bands. Here is the 004 um, zipper case, which I'm a fan of the zipper case. I'm sorry for all the crinkling. Again, oh my gosh, it's two. <laughs> and I ordered more. Oh no, it's not two. It's two on the outside. So the inside has just the big pocket zipper. And then the outside of it has the two like um, credit card style slots. This is more of the same, I believe. I'm gonna just you know check it out in case. Here. Oh no, it's two on each side. So that's kind of cool. And then the zipper case. So I thought, here was my idea. Here's why I got these. Because I was originally going to use my notebooks from, well, my passport, no, pocket notebook from Christina. I think it's a, she calls it field notes. My, um, the little one that I'm going to show you. I originally was going to use it as a wallet. And I'm just not sure if I'm going to, not just because I got this wallet, but um, because I have a couple other ideas and one of them is that I might want to use the smaller one as a journal, use inserts for as a journal for my sons. So without further ado, I'm super excited to open this sucker up. I ordered this from Portugal, from Christina's Leathers. There she is. Um, I'm a fan of the owl. I have an owl tattoo. And oh my goodness, she wrote me a really, really cool little note um, on the back. A handwritten note, which I'm all about. Oh, I thought it was two pieces because it was two different colors. Christmas colors, too. So this took about two and a half weeks from start to finish. Um, it took her about a week to make it. It took about a week and a half for me to get it which she had told me out the gate it was going to be about two to three weeks and I will tell you that I can smell the leather from outside the package um we all know how I feel about that so I'm so oh my gosh I'm so excited oh I lied this is only my one she sent them separately I didn't really I'm a liar again no she didn't okay so here is my dark brown um, like standard size, regular size. Oh my gosh, it's so beautiful. Here's the front. I asked for just this brown, like cream stitching. Here's the back. There's her maker's mark. And it smells so lovely. I love it. Brown elastic. And here we go, y'all. Oh, there's my pen loop. I'm super. What is this? She sent me little extras. Oh my gosh, she's so sweet. How cute. Oh, okay, we'll do that in a second. Um, there's that. So here are the pockets. I custom ordered this whole thing. So let's go through it a little bit. Here is the big pocket. I don't know what that is. Zipper? No. Um, okay, here's the big pocket with the three smaller like credit card slots or any kind of card slots. Secretarial pocket. Oh, this leather is so beautiful. Oh, I love this. Pen loop, I don't have any pen loop on my um, standard Midori, but I also didn't order a pen loop on my other one, so my smaller one, so I'm excited. Um, four bands. Is it? Yeah, four bands. I could not be happier with this out the gate. I. Wow. I just love it. It feels so beautiful. It is just so... I'm just going to keep playing with it. And, wow. The stitching is beautiful. And she does this all herself. 
She is a one-woman show. I know that um, somebody named Pedro, and I don't know if that's her husband or her boyfriend. I don't even know if it's her brother. I don't know. He um, helps her with some things. I know he draws some things for her. Um, but for the most part, this is her gig. And this is just... Oh my goodness, it's beautiful. It's beautiful. So here is what I have been waiting for. Um, this is like my... I have seriously been waiting. She is letting me know on these little notes um, that they're completely handmade with love and care, made out of veg tan leather. She hand dyed it. Oh, this one she hand dyed. So, which is so exciting. And you will, I mean, it's kind of going to be obvious when um, you see that. When you see it, um, she says it's a firmer leather. It's going to soften up a bit. She hopes I love it. She's pretty great. Um, here's this. Oh, look at this blue. Oh, I love it. It is firmer, and it's funny. Um, it's firmer where the pockets are, so it's not all the way around. But I asked to hand dye everything as close to the same color blue as she could, which she obviously did. There is her Maker's Mark again. Love that. This is definitely stiffer, but I think that's why it was going to be cool to use as a wallet. Um, here is the inside. There's my secretarial pocket, my bands, big pocket, smaller pockets, totally stiffer. I, th gosh, I really want to use this as a wallet. I got to figure this out, although I do, it is a good size. Let's see if these fit. Sorry. I'll open up to the center. Oh, that's another thing about these moleskines. They're sewn. I like that. Now see these, um, I don't know how I, however many I'll put in here, but there won't be a lot of overhang because they're too small. So this is more, I think, right? They're too small? I don't know. We'll find out. Because uh, I have another pocket coming um, from um, an incredibly generous person like I told you last week. I love the variation of the blue on this because it is hand dyed. I... I just couldn't be happier. The smell, oh my gosh. Oh, obviously the hand dye smells a little differently than the um, one that's not dyed. It's got these, they both have these little markings on them. Just, they're not imperfections, they're just nature. Same thing with this one. I, oh my gosh. I just love this and I wonder, I, mean, I can't really roll this side, I could this side. But I can't because it's so stiff. Um, again, which is just what makes it perfect for a wallet, I think. I might, the next time I order another one from her, if I um, get the same size, I might skip the pockets and just get like a cover. Um, but this is so beautiful. It's, it, this handiwork is just incredible. And I'm, I could not be happier. Again, um, she's Christina's Leathers on Facebook. I will definitely, definitely um, link her below. So she gave me some washi samples, which I love pineapples. And I don't know what this is. Christina, tell me what this is. Um, and then a little charm. And a little postcard from Portugal, which is beautiful. But this little charm. Gosh, it's so sweet when people do these extra things that you're just not expecting. So, um, thank you for watching. I'm super excited to get these set up. I'm excited to see how this is going to work, um, what I'm going to use them both for. And I hope that you enjoyed learning about um, maybe a new notebook place for you. Um, I cannot recommend her handiwork more. I think that she is outrageously talented. I think that... Um, 
you should go check it out. I the only the hardest part of this whole thing was that I had to wait, and that's because she makes them by hand, and because she is well, you know, in another country. So, um, thank you so much for watching. I can't wait to get these set up. I'm thinking about maybe doing a setup video. I'm not really sure um, when I'll get that going, but um, thank you for watching, and I hope you have an incredible night, and I will see you again soon. Bye.